in today's video I'm going to teach you very very important thing for the customer service have been working in customer service for a long time this is actually one of the important things I have learned LAST or last approach so to get started let's talk a little bit about what is customer service when you have a customers of course you are trying to make more comfortable and happy as possible and also you are trying to meet the needs and expectations and solve the problems or situation they might have there is many many different jobs where you use customer service if you work in hotel restaurant hospitals uh, airports or service stations etc where you are using customer service where you are doing customer service there are many different problems that a customer might have can you imagine can you think some problems customer have uh, maybe uh, somebody charged too much for something maybe they are working in a uh, service station the lines are too long or they are working in store customer gets uh, expired product and sometimes in the ho in the hostel the wifi is in working in the restaurant the customer has been waiting for a long time for food in uh, hotel the beds are uncomfortable so many different problems in different types of business in this video what i'm going to teach you is what do you do when a customer has a problem is a easy method is called the last approach last if a customer has a problem first you should do is listen to their problem then you should do is apologize then solve and thanks now let's try how to apply it first of all listen first you have to find out what is the problem uh, what seems to be the problem you can ask the customer oh, how can i help you once they start explaining what the problem is it's very very important that you look like you are listening and do listen and don't look at the sky don't look at your watch or mobile or you should care what the customer is saying you can repeat back to the customer what they are saying to show that you did understand uh, for example uh, what you are saying uh, there is no hot water in this restaurant so you are not happy with that what you are saying uh, you have been waiting for a long time for food and what you are saying uh, your wifi isn't working in this hotel uh, what you are saying there's no gloves there's no uh, sanitizer in this restaurant so you are not satisfied with that it's important to show that you are listening or and acknowledge what the customer has said tell the customer let me get this right sometimes we have to face very very angry customer he is yelling and shouting and swearing and using very very bad languages if this happens very very important things that you don't get upset if a rude customer making you uncomfortable be polite a smile be friendly say Uh, i really want to help you but your language is getting in the way tell the customer again i understand you are frustrated and please calm down uh, so i can help you you really emphasize that you are there to help them sometimes it doesn't work person keeps yelling shouting uh, and swearing and in that case you call your supervisor or manager good is to do before that uh, 
you can be polite and say the customer use nice language calm down then you can help them next one is apologize it doesn't matter if you didn't anything wrong or if the customer is totally crazy uh, there is no problem you still apologize uh, there is a special way to apologize you do not say it's your fault what you say i'm sorry you have a bad experience uh, this doesn't put blame on anybody uh, you are not saying you made mistakes you are just saying you have a bad experience and this is very important things to do next solve fix the problems and make the things right here if you know how to solve the problem is it easy to solve then you can solve it and but tell them what you are going to do help them how you are going to do to help them for example the wifi is in working in the restaurant or hotels uh, here i am going to help you by sending message to it to fix the wifi so sometimes you don't know how to solve the problems uh, it's better to get your manager or supervisor and uh, inform them uh, i'm not sure how to resolve this situation and let me check with my manager or supervisor the last one is thank uh, thank you for letting us know about the situation we really appreciate it thank you for bringing this in our attention and end in a friendly positive note because you want a customer back uh, let's remember once again what are the steps to solve the problems when customer have a problems number 1 listen number 2 apologize number 3 uh, solve number 4 thank